You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, B&B fans. It's Belinda from Soap Dirt, and there is an official spoiler that has come out for week after next that has me wondering if Sheila Carter is going to find out about this Liam and Steffi kissing secret and blow it wide open. I know a lot of fans agree that the truth needs to come out. It's long overdue. And this new official spoiler, to me, hints that it might be time. I'm going to tell you about the spoiler. We're going to talk about how this would play out and why it's so important. But if you haven't already, please reach down, click subscribe, so you don't miss any of our B&B updates. Now, let's dig in. First of all, I think we can all agree that the Steffi and Liam kiss thing has been hidden for too long. Liam kissed Steffi once in Italy. That was June 23rd, and that was right after seeing Thomas and Hope smooching, specifically seeing Hope try to eat Thomas's face and seeing that she was the aggressor. And then a week later on June 30th, Liam did it again at the house she shares with her husband, Finn. The first time it was emotionally wrought and she was right there and he was very raw and he was just sad. So I, I kind of can forgive the first one. The second one, he told Hope he wanted a divorce. He went and talked to Wyatt and he thought it through. And then he got in the car and he drove to their house and he made, to me, a premeditated decision to kiss her and try and ruin her marriage because he said, it's time to move on with my life. And then he kissed her like he was thinking, oh, well, if I'm not with Hope, obviously I get Steffi back by default. And since then, he's kind of gotten himself all worked up about, oh, you know, leaving her was the worst decision of my life. I never should have done it, blah, blah, blah. But if you guys remember the way he left her, it was horrible. And she doesn't need to entertain his waffling, trifling butt for one minute. But right now, it's been almost three months, and this dirty little secret of Liam's remains hidden. Liam lied by omission to Hope, and Steffi lied by omission to Finn because they both owed it to their spouses to come clean and face whatever consequences that there were. And if you remember the scene in Italy, the first time he kissed her, she actually kind of grabbed a hold of his sleeves, you know, and then the second time she had kind of a shocked face, but she didn't slap him, you know, or anything like that. And then he went for a third kiss, if you remember, over at the Forrester Mansion, and that time she turned her head. But she still didn't slap him and write him a reality check like I think you should if you're married and your ex-husband's trying to kiss on you. Fans, a lot of fans, are really irritated that this has stayed hidden for so long. And with Steffi gone, you know, maybe it's the best time to reveal it. So a spoiler for the week of September the, is it the 25th? Yeah, for the week of the 25th through the 29th might hint that the reveal, the long overdue reveal, is finally happening. So official bold spoilers promise that an eavesdropper learns a big secret. So the spoiler, that's the whole spoiler that inspired this video. And it says someone eavesdrops and hears a stunning secret. So let's think about what is secret right now. There is a Deacon and Sheila secret engagement teased to happen on September 22nd. That was teased in the season 37 spoilers. So that's definitely a secret, but they're pretty careful and stay behind closed doors. So I just can't imagine somebody being able to eavesdrop on them. And again, the engagement isn't confirmed. This To me, this sounds like a secret that's been kept. Thomas and Hope doing the deed all the time. It's a secret to some extent, but Brooke and Ridge both know and kind of Douglas gets a little inkling and it just didn't feel like that. You know, it's, it's private, but I don't necessarily know if it's secret other than them just trying to avoid Brooke's wrath and lecturing. Eric's line is not a secret anymore. And this week, it seems like he and Donna are going to reveal what's 
actually medically wrong with him to RJ this week. So yeah, he's hiding something. So maybe intern Luna overhears them talking. I don't know. There's lots of things that it could be. But what I hope, what I fervently hope is that it's Sheila overhearing about the kisses. Right now, Sheila really wants to break up Finn's marriage, and this information would help her so much. With Steffi gone to Europe, the only way for Sheila to overhear it is for it to come out of Liam's mouth or Wyatt's mouth. Because right now, I think they're the only ones who know. I'm not sure. I'm trying to remember. You guys remind me in the comments. For some reason, I know that Dollar Bill knows that Liam wants Steffi back, but I don't know if he knows about the kissing. I just, that's not in my gray matter right now. So let me know if you remember him confirming it because Liam was kind of being cagey and it was Wyatt who was busting him out to their dad. So I could totally picture Wyatt and Liam eating at Il Giardino and, you know, talking about it and Wyatt asking what he's going to do and if he regrets kissing her those two two times and I could totally see Sheila lurking nearby with her hat and sunglasses because it's Deacon's place and she likes to come there but she doesn't want to get him in trouble so she wears her little disguise so I could totally see that being how she could hear it or she already knows that she wants Steffi out of Finn's life so maybe she's deliberately lurking around Liam or following him around and hears it so remember Deacon was worried that Sheila was going to hurt Steffi but what she really wants is for Steffi to hurt Finn if you remember when Sheila came back from the big argument with Steffi at the Malibu house after Finn kicked her out of the house and said you're out of my life go away uh, she told Deacon, Sheila told Deacon, I don't think Steffi's going to be a problem for much longer. And Deacon immediately was like, Sheila, what does that mean? Because he doesn't want blood on Sheila's hands because that will translate to problems for him. But I don't think he needs to worry about physical danger where Steffi is concerned. I think that there's something else in mind. Sheila already talked to herself, you know, as they do on soap operas. I don't know about you guys, but when I'm scheming to do bad things to people, I don't sit in my living room and talk out loud. I like to just think about it in my head. Just kidding. I don't really uh, think about scheming that much, right? <laughs> do any of us actually, but do you sit around and talk to yourself like that? I think that's a sign of serious mental illness or being a soap opera character, one or the other. So it was like a couple of weeks ago, I think. It was right after Finn kicked her out of the house and she was sitting on Deacon's couch in his crappy little apartment and she was mulling over how she could remain in Finn's life. She knows for sure that Steffi is the obstacle. She sees Steffi as the only obstacle. There's more to it than that, but Sheila's kind of narrow-minded on this topic. And so Sheila was talking to herself about how losing Steffi would break Finn's heart, but he'd get over it and it would be the best thing for him in the long run. So she also, I think, probably assumes that brokenhearted Finn might need his real mom, as she likes to think of herself, you know? And next week, there's more official spoilers. Lee Finnegan wants Finn to get rid of Sheila, and then Sheila and Finn make some decisions. That comes the week of the 18th through the 22nd. Official bold spoilers for Wednesday the 20th say that Lee tells Finn, get rid of Sheila for good. I mean, Lee was happy to see her die, so maybe she means he should kill her. I don't know. And then the next day on September 21st, on Thursday, Sheila makes a decision, and so does Finn. These are decisions about each other, but made separately. So maybe he listens to his adoptive mom and decides, all right, I need to take drastic action. And maybe Sheila decides to ruin his marriage if she can figure out how to make it happen. So then the eavesdropping happens the following week, the same week of interest that Taylor is in town. The week of the 25th says that Finn leans on Taylor. And so far that we know of, Taylor doesn't know about the kisses. Of course, Steffi might have told her off screen. Even so, I don't think that Taylor would tell Finn. However, there could be another way 
related to Taylor that Sheila could eavesdrop and find out. For instance, if Sheila went over and was lurking around the Malibu house, hoping to get a chance to talk to Finn, maybe she would overhear Taylor on the phone talking to Steffi and saying things, have you decided to tell Finn that you've kissed Liam twice? So that is totally another valid way presuming that Steffi has come clean to her mother, which she might well do. So that same week is the eavesdropping spoiler saying someone overhears a huge secret, but we don't know what's the secret or who is listening in on it, but I am cheerleading for it to be Sheila about these kisses. Hey, if you haven't already, please reach down and click subscribe so you don't miss any of our updates and click like if you're enjoying this. So if Sheila overhears this secret, it definitely could be the key to her ending Steffi and Finn's marriage as she hopes to do. All we know right now is that Sheila is determined to end their marriage, but I don't think she has a plan yet. I think she has a goal, but not a plan. So she can't just knock on the door and say, hey, I think you should leave Steffi. I don't think that's any good for you. She needs to break them up, and that means she needs a plan, and this information, if she gets it, could feel that plan. Finding out that Steffi kissed her ex-husband twice could be a deal breaker, especially depending on how it is described to him because Finn already forgave Steffi for sleeping with Liam and they had that whole baby Hayes paternity test thing that was just horrible. But finding out that Steffi has kissed Liam and then all the stuff that he already has with little puke could be just too much for Finn to forgive. If Sheila finds out about the smooches, then she would have to try and find a way to let Finn know without telling him because I don't think he would believe her. But maybe Sheila could pull a Liam and record it and then send the file to Finn's phone anonymously so there's no denying the truth of it and she would have deniability that she was involved. She could, you know, video Liam talking to Wyatt if that's the way it comes out, if it comes out, or if she hears Taylor on the phone, she could video that. So it would be pretty ironic if Sheila did record them because Liam recording Fen hugging Sheila is what already put a crack in that marriage. And if Sheila then retaliated by recording, it could finish their marriage off. What do you guys think? Are you ready for this secret to come out? Or do you want it to stay hidden indefinitely so that Sheila can't break up Steffi and Finn? Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I read all your comments. I appreciate them so much. Thank you for tuning in. This has been Belinda from Soap Dirt. Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcast, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more. <laughs>